Greetings students, staff, parents, and community partners. It is my pleasure to welcome you to the Fulton High School Class of 2020 Senior Awards Ceremony. We are extremely excited to honor this year's senior class. Our goal at Fulton continues to be graduation for all students who enter and for all who leave Fulton to contribute to the community in which they choose to live. Each senior has embraced this vision and we are here to celebrate their achievements. Introducing the Fulton High School Class of 2020.
At this time, we would like to recognize the academic top 10%. Valedictorian, Chloe Hammock. Co-salutatorian, Thomas Andrew Barnett. Co-salutatorian, Hannah Hobby. Top 10%, Sharon Sharp, Riley Wyatt, Emily Stout, Malia Myers, Ariana Smith, Nicole Cooney, Haley Doherty, Christopher Dalton, Daniela Lopez, Jared Kirchensteiner, Dariella Rodriguez Herrera, Rachel Bradley, Callie Anderson, Skydasia Miller, Bryson Hartzell, Isabella Gregg, Asia Walton, and Alyssa Linder. Congratulations to the top 10%. Students who are designated as graduating with distinction must attain a 3.0 GPA, earn a national or state recognized industry certification, or earn 12 or more hours of post-secondary credit. Students graduating with distinction. Allison Broughton, Andre Riddles, Andrew Muncie, Bryson Hartzell, Cheyenne Hamilton, Skydasia Miller, Daniela Lopez, Daphne Qualls, Edgar Martin, Elizabeth Inman, Gaja Davenport, Jaquez Clegg, Janiah Goins, Jennifer Donis Felipe, Kiaya Ballinger, Kylie Smith, Rachel Bradley, Lixie Diaz, Jashante Hill. Students who are designated as graduating with honors must attain a 3.0 GPA and score at or above the following on the ACT. 18 in English, 22 in math, 23 in science, and a 22 in reading. These are the students graduating with honors. Raven Chambers, Carlos Lopez, Robert Nix, Thomas Andrew Barnett, Riley Wyatt, Aiden Melton, Chloe Hammock, Hannah Hobby, Rachel Bradley, and Sharon Sharp. At this time, we would like to recognize our senior ambassadors. These students were chosen to represent Fulton High School during special events, greeting visitors, giving tours, and assisting counselors and principals when called upon. This year's ambassadors are Titus Cole, Ishana Houston, Abigail Lopez, Riley Wyatt, Callie Anderson, Lixie Diaz, Janiah Goins, Gret Nikimpe, Talia Prentice, Andre Riddles, Jada Logan, and Emily Stout. Hello, I'm Bill Larson. I'm the Key Club Advisor for Fulton Key Club from the Qantas Club at Northside Knoxville. Qantas is a global organization of volunteers dedicating to serving the world one child and one community at a time. And we're very pleased to be a, taking part of that by helping to sponsor the Key Club at Fulton High School. I'm here today to present the uh, Key Club Participation Award, which is a medal to be worn on the gowns of the graduating seniors who've qualified. And I'm also going to be presenting an Andy Hudson uh, Service Award from Northside Kiwanis. Our five service medal winners this year are Janaya Goins, Brett Nikimpe, Daniela Lopez, Tyra Tabers, and Nicole Cooney. We want to, on behalf of Ms. Cartwright and myself, co-sponsors of Key Club, we want to congratulate these five students for completing the requisite hours and membership requirements to receive this service medal. And I'd also like to recognize Nicole for applying for and being granted a $500 grant, uh, 
service award from Key Club for her sir from Northside Kiwanis for her service uh, in the community this year. So congratulations, Nicole, and congratulates to all of the uh, Key Club graduates from Fulton. Okay, the Golden Eagle Scholarship is awarded annually to an East Tennessee graduating high school student of Latinx descent. One of this year's recipients is Fulton's Dariela Rodriguez Herrera. Congratulations. I am presenting on behalf of the Great Smoky Mountains Institute at Tremont. Today, we are honoring the graduates of the Environmental and Community Leaders Fellowship. Thomas Andrew Barnett, Raven Chambers, Janiah Goins, Cheyenne Hamilton, Zurich Hudson, Elizabeth Inman, Aidan Melton, Skydasia Miller, Andrew Muncie, Gret Nikampai, Daphne Qualls, Sharon Sharp, Rainey Torrey, and Riley Wyatt. Several students have stood out as leaders throughout the two years of this program, and we want to recognize them with the Excellence in Environmental and Community Leadership Award. These students are Zurich Hudson, Andrew Muncie, Daphne Qualls, Rainey Torrey, and Raven Chambers. We can't wait to see how you will continue to lead us towards a better, brighter future in which the whole community is connected to nature and invested in its protection. I am Janae Peterson and I am the coordinator of education and youth services with the Knoxville Area Urban League and I specifically work with our National Achievers Society and today I am here to present the honor stoles for all of our Fulton graduates who received the honor stole from the National Achievers Society this year. So I'd like to congratulate the following scholars, Gaja Davenport, Bryson Hartzell, Jatori Howard, Zurich Hudson, Gret Nissenpaye, Andre Riddles II, Caesar Tino, Rainey Torrey, Asia Walton, and Xavier Wynn. We are so, so proud of you, and we'd like to say congratulations to our scholars and to the entire class of 2020. Knox County Schools, in association with the Partners in Education program, presents the Barney Thompson Scholarship. A graduating senior from each Knox County High School will be selected to receive a one-time $500 scholarship. The Barney Thompson Scholarship Program is named in honor of a former teacher and coach at South High School who impacted the lives of each student in his classroom and on his teams. He later served as treasurer of the Partners in Education Advisory Board and was instrumental in connecting many organizations in our community to the schools he was so passionate about. Upon his death, the scholarship program was established by the PIE Advisory Board in his name. This scholarship is open to graduating seniors from all 16 Knox County public high schools and one scholarship will be awarded at each high school. The recipient of this year's award representing Fulton High School goes to Crystalyn Callie Anderson. The Knoxville Alumni Chapter of Delta Sigma Theta Sorority Incorporated provides scholarships to graduating African American females. In order to be considered, students must have at least a 3.0 grade point average and plan to attend a college, university, or a technical school as a full-time student. The application process includes submitting an online application, submission of two letters of recommendation, an essay highlighting their academic and personal accomplishments, school and community involvement, and their educational and career goals, and an interview with the scholarship committee. This year, a total of 12 scholarships were awarded. I have the distinct honor of recognizing two Fulton seniors. The award will go to Chrysalyn Kelly Anderson and Gret Nikampai. Congratulations, young ladies, on your accomplishments and achievements. On behalf of Civitan International, the Appalachian Civitan District, and Civitan in North Knoxville, it is with great pleasure that we recognize and honor this morning our special winners for the Civitan Club Allison Doak Scholarship Program. These two very special scholarships, with our congratulations and best wishes, are awarded to Jamal Darty and to Tyra Tabers. And now, on behalf of our Civitan Club, we would like to honor another senior student with a special Civitan Award. 
This award is being given to a most deserving, outstanding Fulton High senior who has demonstrated great qualities in academics, athletics, citizenship, leadership, and peer tutoring. This special Civitan Award, with our congratulations and best wishes, is awarded to Dominic Holland. Thank you and congratulations to the Fulton High Class of 2020. On behalf of the Fulton High School Alumni Association, I would like to congratulate Bryson Hartzell and Emily Stout on winning a $1,000 scholarship. We hope this will help you with your future plans of education. Again, congratulations from the Fulton High School Alumni Association. Congratulations to Hannah Hobby, Zurich Hudson, and Yasmin Martinez for being selected to receive the North Knoxville Business and Professionals Association Scholarship for the year 2020. Your focus and dedication has inspired our business association, and we look forward to seeing amazing accomplishments in your future. Congratulations again, and well done! Presented on behalf of the North Knoxville Business and Professionals Association membership and President George Bovey. Hi, my name is Ola Blackman McBride, and I am president of Alpha Pi Omega Chapter of Alpha Kappa Alpha Sorority Incorporated. Today, I'm here representing our chapter foundation, Alpha Pi Omega Foundation. The Alpha Pi Omega Foundation of Alpha Kappa Alpha Sorority Incorporated provides scholarships to eligible high school seniors who have a desire to continue their education. The Alpha Pi Omega has, Foundation has been awarding uh, scholarships for over 30 years. Today, we are here to recognize one of Fulton's uh, graduates. Uh, we would like to acknowledge today Mr. Bryson Harson. Mr. Bryson will be one of five recipients to receive a $1,500 scholarship. And I'd like to note that Alpha Pi Omega last year awarded more than $15,000 in freshman and continuing ed scholarships. Congratulations, Mr. Harshaw, and to all the entire graduating Fulton High School class. And now, Fulton High School would like to recognize its 2020 Project Grad Scholarship recipients. Congratulations, Fulton High, Class of 2020, recipient of the Xavier Dobson Memorial Scholarship. Your essay letters to Zay excelled in the classroom, preparing yourself for higher learning. Selflessness 
taught you perseverance. Now rise above towards your next level. Your strength is amazing. I admire your leadership. Go forth to serve. And now I'm proud to announce the winner, Dariella Rodriguez Herrera. She's the 2020 recipient of the Zavion Dobson Memorial Scholarship. You excelled and I am so proud of you. I'm sure that Zavion is from heaven smiling down and thank you so much. Now we're moving on to the Community Service Awards. Our school motto is enter to learn, go forth to serve. As a result of that, we ask our students to give back to the community in a variety of ways, such as serving Fulton as an ambassador and completing community service as part of their portfolios. Several of our students have, have gone above and beyond this year in the area of service. These students have been recognized for their commitment to community service. Abigail Lopez, 66 hours of community service. Zurich Hudson, 37 hours. Nicole Cooney, over 100 hours. Gret Nikimpe, the Bonner Scholarship. Dennis Ramirez Ortiz, the Optimus Club Service to Humanity Award. Callie Anderson, 100 hours of community service. Congratulations to the Fulton High School class of 2020. My name is Keith Leonard and I represent the teachers of the English department. Today, we are presenting the English Award. The English Award is given to a senior who has been nominated by at least one of his or her English teachers, exhibits excellent literary and writing skills, and exudes a love of the discipline that we love to teach. In fact, this individual could one day be a colleague of ours. Please join me in congratulating the Class of 2020 recipient of the Fulton English Department Award, Ms. Jatori Howard. Bonjour, hola, guten tag, konnichiwa. I'm here, I'm Emily Dalton, and I'm here today to present the World Language Award. And this year we have chosen one recipient of that award, and that goes to our sole French 3 student, Mr. Alex Bodio. Ms. Seidler and Ms. Haskell would like to honor two students with the Outstanding Artist Award, Raven Chambers and Abigail Lopez. Both have shown extraordinary commitment to their creative pursuits in multiple art classes and open studios over the last four years. The following students have been awarded Peer Tutor of the Year for demonstrating outstanding leadership roles, being positive role models, and treating all students with integrity and respect. Congratulations to Mateo Francisco Andres and Ishana Houston. Project U is a district-wide club that exists to promote inclusion and kindness on campus. At Fulton, Project U works hard to help every student feel recognized and valued. Project U's senior leadership team this year included Sharon Sharp, Xavier Wynn, Janaya Goins, Danielle Lopez, Skydasha Miller, Gret Nikampai, Henriette Nishimwe, Aisha Reese, Geza Davenport, and Shabria Davis. Hi, I'm Darian Bruce, and this is Emily Dalton, and we're the sponsors of the National Honor Society. All of our senior members had to maintain a 3.5 GPA and eight hours of community service each semester, and we would like to recognize those seniors right now. Our officers were Chris Dalton, President, Bryson Hartzell, Vice President, Crystalyn Callie Anderson, Secretary, Rachel Bradley, historian, and Sharon Sharp, treasurer. And the rest of our members include Ms. Nicole Cooney, Haley Dougherty, Chloe Hammock, Hannah Hobby, Jatori Howard, Daniela Lopez, Jasmine Martinez, Aidan Melton, Andrew Muncy, Gret Nikampe, Sebastian Pedro, Talia Prentice, Andre Riddles, Natalie Simmons, Kylie Smith, Emily Stout, Julio Tino, Asia Walton, and Enday Walton. Hey guys, I'm Sean Walker. I'm the Science Department Chair and I have the privilege um, of giving 
um, our award this year in recognizing one of uh, our outstanding seniors. Um, the list uh, of outstanding seniors in our department were, you know, it's quite long, so we had to narrow it down. But it's my privilege to recognize Andrew Barnett um, for our award this year. He did an outstanding job in the classroom and outside of the classroom. And we're so proud of uh, all that he's done here at Fulton. So congrats, Andrew. Hey seniors, uh, we miss you very much. We are giving outstanding awards for the senior class. You ready? Let's ready? go. Outstanding musician. Uh, we have two this year, Ms. Cheyenne Hamilton and Mr. Jesse Marshall. Uh, for outstanding percussion, uh, we have nominated Jared Kirchensteiner. Nice. And for outstanding color guard, uh, we're going to go with Chrissy Mashburn. The Esprit de Corps Award, which is the spirit of the music spirit of the band, goes to Mr. Andy Nairo Quintana. We love you guys and miss you. Hi, I'm Darian Bruce, the department head of the Social Studies Department, and I'm here to give our department award. Every year we award um, one senior for um, their excellent work in the discipline of social studies, and this year that award goes to Ms. Hannah Hobby. Hi, class of 2020. My name is Kimberly Young, and as the department chair of mathematics, I have the honor of presenting the National Council of Supervisors of Mathematics Award for Excellence in Mathematics. This award is given to the student with the highest grade in AP Calculus. So this year, the student who gets the award is Carlos Lopez. Congratulations, Carlos, from everyone here at the math department. Uh, your award will be mailed to you. Hello, this is Coach Ra, and I'm here to honor this senior year's class with our annual athletic awards. These awards were voted on and decided by our coaching staff. Our first athletic award is our academic award, which is given to our senior athlete with the highest grade point average. And that award goes to Hannah Hobby. Our cheerleading award, we had a tie this year. And there are two young ladies that we're going to honor with our cheerleading award, and that is Emily Stout and Hannah Hobby. Our 110% award. Our coaches decided on this young man, and he exemplifies this and everything that he did, and that's Mr. Zurich Hudson. And our most prestigious awards for male and female athlete of the year, and they are our female athlete of the year is Gaza Davenport. And our Male Athlete of the Year is Edward Lacey. Congratulations, seniors, and an outstanding class, Fulton High School, Class of 2020. Hello, my name is Steve Morell, and I teach Digital Arts and Design and Photography here at Fulton High School in the School of Communications, also known as Fulcom. I'm here to present the Outstanding Photography Achievement Award. This year's recipient has photographed just about every football game since her freshman year and many other school events. Her photos have been published on the Fullcom News Service Facebook page and also in the Knoxville Focus newspaper. This award goes to a very dependable, hardworking, and talented young lady, Nicole Cooney. Congratulations, Nicole. Hello. My name is Stephen Wilkinson, if you didn't know, and I have the honor today of introducing the Fulton High School Communications SLC. Um, while we weren't together long this year, I can honestly say that this class has left an indelible mark on me, um, as it is my first senior graduating class here at Fulton High School. Um, this obviously has been a very unique year, and even though it's not how anyone imagined it, you did it. You graduated. Congratulations. Nothing's ever going to be able to take that away from you. So. Just for me to you, I'm confident that all of you will lead, go on, you'll lead extraordinary lives, you'll do wonderful things. All right, now we're gonna give out some senior awards. First off, we're gonna give out our Dean's Award. The Dean Award goes to the student in our SLC that attained the highest GPA. And for the class of 2020, that is Emily Stout. Emily, a dedicated student who now joins the ranks of prior Fullcom graduates who have worked hard to achieve this award. 
Congratulations, Emily. Next up is our Most Improved Senior Award. Now this award goes to a student who has shown outstanding growth in the classroom from their junior year to senior year. This year, the recipient is Mary Gibbs. Congratulations and well done, Mary. Moving on to the Turnaround Award. Now this is an award that goes to a senior who has made a change for the better. This award is not just about academics, this is about the change in attitude and perspective. So this year that award goes to Montez Ferran. Congratulations, Montez. And finally, perfect attendance. Every year we honor those students who showed up every single day, no matter what. And this year we have seven seniors who accomplished that. Those people are Raven Chambers, Christopher Dalton, Isabella Gregg, Joshua Jones, Emily Stout, Tyra Tabers, and Inde Walton. Congratulations to all those seniors who earned awards and to all of the class of 2020. Thank you. Hello, my name is Donna Brunson and I have the honor of introducing the Skilled Professions Small Learning Community. I can honestly say that this class of seniors will forever be in my mind as, and my heart as is my first graduating class at Fulton High School. This has been a whirlwind of a year and even though this is not how you thought you would do it, you did it. And nothing can take that from you. So congratulations to the class of 2020. We are so very proud of you. And we know that you will go on and do amazing things. Now here is Miss Natalie McGee to announce your senior awards. The Dean's Award recognizes the student in the School of Skilled Professions with the highest GPA. Thomas Andrew Barnett has been described as kind, with a great sense of humor, who is always willing to help his peers. He is a dedicated student who now joins the ranks of other skilled professions graduates who have worked hard to have the highest GPA in our small learning community. Congratulations, Andrew. Next is the Most Improved Senior Award. This award goes to students who have shown the most academic growth from junior to senior year. Here is, one of, here is what one of his teachers, Ms. Henry, had to say. I am extremely proud of Francisco. He has worked so hard this year to raise his GPA and also to gain knowledge in general. Francisco is not afraid to ask questions and loves to master new skills. He took school very seriously this year and not only had the goal to graduate, but also to have A's and B's in all of his classes. His English skills have also developed and improved throughout his high school career and I am so proud of him. Congratulations and well done, Francisco Manuel Francisco. The Turnaround Award goes to a senior who has a change for the better. This award is not just about academics, but instead focuses on attitude. When asked about DeMarcus, Coach Harbison had this to say. DeMarcus is a young man who worked super hard to accomplish the things he needed to do in order to graduate. He worked nonstop in class to make sure that he completed all of the courses that he needed. He is one of the most dedicated young men that I have seen work in the Learning Center. He made the decision that he was going to graduate and he dedicated himself to that goal and he accomplished it. He is an outstanding young man and Ms. D calls him the epitome of the Turnaround Award. Congratulations, Demarcus Lewis. And lastly, the Perfect Attendance Award goes to students who come in every day ready to learn. I can say that my day was made better from seeing these two in my class and in the hallway. Way to go, Abigail Lopez and Andy Quintana. On behalf of the Health Science SLC and all of the teachers in our department, we want to say a huge congratulations to all of our seniors. You have done a remarkable job this year. And on behalf specifically of Mrs. Deaton and myself, we just want to say that we love you and we miss you around the office. And without any further waiting around, Ms. Abbott is going to come and present our Health Science SLC awards. Hello everyone, this is Ms. Abbott and I am presenting the Health Science Awards, SLC Awards. Our perfect attendance this year, awards for students who did not miss a day of school, are for Bryson Hartzell, Hannah Hobby, Joshua Jackson, Andrew Muncy, Daphne Qualls, Kylie Smith, and Andrew Wicks. Congratulations on not missing a day of school. We are also giving two awards for improvement in academics. Our most improved over the course of her senior year award goes to Yolitsin Medina Lopez. Congratulations, y'all. Turnaround award goes to LaShawn Freeman for turning his academic career around from freshman year to senior year. Congratulations, LaShawn. You've done a great job. 
And our Dean's Award is awarded to the student every year in health science who graduates with the highest GPA. This year, we not only have the highest GPA in our SLC, but also in the school. Chloe Hammock is our school valedictorian and is also the winner of this year's Dean's Award. Congratulations, Chloe, and to all the class of 2020. And now we will give out our senior class awards. On behalf of the administrative team at Fulton High School, I am honored to recognize this year's senior class award recipients in the categories of citizenship, leadership, and outstanding seniors. The word citizenship is used to describe someone who is able to represent themselves and their community with the utmost integrity. This year's Citizenship Award winner is Abigail Lopez. Good leaders are sensitive to the needs of others and must also know what it means to follow, knowing that in doing so, others are following too, but watching you along the way. This year's Leadership Award winner is Sharon Sharp. The next award being presented uh, is for our outstanding seniors. This award is to recognize seniors who represent everything we strive as a school to develop in our students. These individuals excel across the board. They demonstrate qualities such as character, work ethic, and talent. This year's outstanding seniors will certainly be a lasting part of Fulton High School's legacy. We are proud to announce this year's winners, Danielle Lopez, Zurich Hudson, and Mateo Francisco Andres. In closing, I would like to take just a moment and uh, recognize and thank the class of 2020 again, uh, a class that has overcome many obstacles, uh, endured hardships, and excelled at every turn. Uh, obviously, uh, the end of the uh, senior year uh, didn't quite end like everyone wanted, uh, but hopefully just a little bit of a roadblock on your way to doing great things in the future. We have doctors, lawyers, nurses, teachers, uh, professional athletes. We have all uh, students uh, in this class that will excel at whatever they do. Extremely proud to be your principal. Extremely proud of the class of 2020. Uh, you entered to learn four years ago, and now it is time to go forth to serve. Uh, you will always be a Falcon, and you can always call 2509 home. Thank you.